Hello, my name is Lei Chung. Um, today I'm going to demonstrate our official tongue uh, demo. Uh, just a lovely day today, so it's perfect for a demonstration. Um, artificial tongue is basically in case you get disease or you get actually cut off the tongue, you could actually replace it and it would try to emulate the tongue and uh, speech will uh, speak out. Before you, before we do the, the demo, you need to know a few things about tongue. Your tongue is working like this. So it works as in like a wave. So what you do is extract the wave file and the electric um, impulses. You could, you could convert that into a binary, binary convert into decimal. And the brain software could put the decimal into ABC English so you would understand. So that's how you communicate. Uh, so, so this is how I'm going to design our visual tongue. So basically, once again, you need to wire into your cheek here, uh, not too deep. And you also need to wire connected to your dorsal one half of your tongue. So if you cut your tongue more than one half, it's not going to work. So if you cut less than one half, your tongue, whatever reason you get cut less than half, then our special tongue will work. I need to go to the washroom. I need water. I need water. My blood sugar level is high. I am not feeling well. I need to go to the washroom. My blood sugar level is high. Can you call the doctor? I love EDM class. I love EDM class. I need water. My blood sugar level is high. I need to go to the washroom. I am hungry. So, conversion. Um, this is the first prototype, so it, it could only... The database, I am track and update the base to make it more talk more. So in the future, maybe version 2, it is able to talk more than, than a few sentences. But either way, that's how the artificial tongue works. Okay, the downfall of this current uh, version 1 of artificial tongue is you have to put 2 Y into your cheek here. Uh, and 2 Y into your dorsal tongue uh, one half. Uh, if your tongue can cut anything more than that, then it's not going to work. But um, hopefully version 2 will improve. But for this version, I bought a lot of band-aid with me, so in case it's not bleeding here, I could just replace it and do more demo. That's about it. Uh, you're probably wondering why I did artificial tongue. Well, sitting inside histo class, learning the tongue system, I say to myself, hey, why not? Might as well put histo into a uh, real application use. So there you go, artificial tongue. I don't know what it's really useful. Not many people lose their tongue, but uh, hopefully it will be useful one of these days.